It's here, Duncan. And um, I asked Corey Besmer to junior prom. How did you do it? I got a fortune cookie and I put a fortune in it that said, I see a prom in your future. And then we had food that night and I brought fortune cookies and I gave him that one. Yeah. How'd you get the note inside the fortune cookie? I, um, well, this piece of paper that was originally in it was sticking out. So I just pulled that one out and then cut a little strip of piece of paper and put it in. What was his reaction like? Um, he was, well, at first he didn't read the fortune because he's like, well, I have to eat the cookie first and then read the fortune. And so, um, he didn't see it at first. It was like, like five minutes later. And then he was like, oh yeah, I'll go to prom with you. So, oh. Yeah. <laughs> was we, there any tears? No. How much planning did all of this take? Um, it took me and my friend right before. Four. We just went online and we were looking up ways to do it, so it didn't take too long. It was just we had to go buy a cookie, some cookies, and put it in. So you had friends help you? Yeah. My friend Lizzie Rainey helped me. So she yelled at me because I hadn't asked her yet. And said I was going to take uh, Aspen's date because he hadn't asked her either. And I was just going to take Aspen. But then Aspen asked Chloe, and then that wasn't an option for me anymore. So she went snowboarding and left her car at my house. So I found my, all my mom's lipstick that she didn't use anymore, and I wrote a paragraph on every single car window that she had. And little tiny writing and lipstick that doesn't come off. But she said yes, and now she just has to clean up. It's all good. But I'm leaving it while I'm at boot camp again, so that he can clean it off. I'm just gonna rewrite it. It's all good. And I wanted to do something that involved being outside. And I was riding all night in the middle of the street. People were looking at me really weirdly because they thought I was probably going to do that to their car next. Yeah, just get me. How much time did it take? Uh, 30 minutes. Are you okay with him? It took me like four minutes. It's going to take him longer to get it off. No, no. Two? No, no. no let's see, I, me and two other people spent like two hours trying to get it off last night. Two hours, night. 20 minutes. Don't get it. I'm just gonna like, I have a track meet, I'm not gonna be home by then. I'm gonna leave it tomorrow when I'm at work. Oh, that sucks, because you're not, I'll just drive it away. <laughs> Who asked you to junior prom? Um, Aspen Fernando. Can you? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how did he ask you? Well, we went to our six month anniversary dinner at Primo's Pizza. Was it, was it Primo's Pizza? And then afterwards, um, he said he had to go grab something at his house. And he asked me to get out of the car. And on this driveway, it was like prom and like Christmas lights. And it was, yeah, it was really adorable. Were you expecting this at all? Not. Well, I knew that he was asking me to prom, but like not that way. How did you think he was going to ask you? I don't know. I didn't expect it to be that Remember you guys out there. Remember that? Remember you guys went to the went to I fell on the So how excited are you? I'm really excited that it's 30 miles per hour. And I just fall. It feels like, because I bought my dress back in December. Just because like I got out of online. And now it feels like December to March is like gone by that quick. So I'm really excited. Very nice. Are you guys going to... How much time did you put into this? It was kind of like, I don't know. I had a plan in a week earlier so I could get arranged the Christmas lights and everything, but yeah, it took a lot of time. Did anybody help you? No, it was all me. It was all me. Really? Yeah. Well, think about it. You know, did you ask for help? I don't need help. <laughs> I really don't need help. Because nobody's going to, I'm the one asking you to prom, so why would I need help? Nobody else does. That's cute. I don't know why you want to see that. Where'd you come up with this idea of Christmas lights? Well, it came to a dream, really. It really, like, it's like an epiphany where, like, it just came to me. So, yeah. Really? Yes. When was the dream? Well, I was studying for my bio test. Oh, and then they called me. I fell asleep in the book. And I guess the knowledge of OBP bio just came to me. And like, just like lights sparkling in my head, it was Christmas lights. And I was like, that's how I'm asking you to prom. Bingo. Okay. We have to get.